Life-saving rescue along the Cape Cod Canal. Wareham police officers pulling five people from the water after they were thrown from a boat. The chief of police says his officers risked their lives and the conditions were so dangerous, this could have had a much different outcome. Jim Smith has details on the rescue now from Cape Cod. It was pitch black and I just heard people screaming for their lives in the darkness. So. A life and death ocean struggle in the dark of night. A boat with five people on board hits this buoy. That boat is badly damaged and all five are thrown into the chilly waters of Buzzards Bay. Two Wareham police officers rushed to the scene. As soon as I got there and got out of my car and I heard the people screaming for their lives, uh, I, you know, I put it right in the air that I had people in the water. Three of the people were clinging to the buoy, but two others were still in the water. Officer James White did not waste any time. It's just so dark out there. There's no light at all. Um, I could just see two, two heads in the water. I could hear them screaming, help, help, help. So I just, just started swimming to them. It had the life preserver and stuff in it, and they, they kind of grabbed hold of it, and I just started towing them in. The boat is owned by Mattapoiset Fire Chief Andrew Murray, and he was one of those rescued. Town officials are delighted everybody's okay as investigators figure out how this happened. So I've been in communication with our police chief, who's actually traveling right now, and we've talked a few times, and we're... Uh, you know, talking with the folks at the Wareham Police Department to get the reports and then, you know, do a careful review, find out what, you know, what the details are. The town manager says Chief Murray took a personal day on Tuesday, but he's expected back to work soon. Massachusetts Environmental Police are investigating the accident. In Wareham, Jim Smith, WBZ News.